Folge 19 von The Wolf Among Us. Der Nocebo begrüßt euch ein weiteres Mal und hofft, ihr seid genauso gespannt darauf, den Crooked Man den Arsch aufzureißen wie ich. <lacht> Ach, lebendig. Völlig überbewertet. Tempo. Zeit für sowas. Bei Anklopfen wäre natürlich cool gewesen. Hm. So ganz ohne Backup und ach. Oh, das ist spannend. Tim, what the hell are you doing here? Good evening, Sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. I know you aren't here on a social call. Hold on. You've just been waiting for me to show up? You knew I was coming? That's what they told me. I don't know, they said you made it pretty clear. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Look, this is the one thing I have to do. Fine, lead on. Das ist aus Dickens, oder? Hier ein ein uh, ja, ach ihr wisst schon, uh, Winter uh, Weihnachtsmärchen. This is all I'm here to do and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard, or an escort for that matter. I was a little surprised myself when they asked me to do it. You shouldn't be here, Tim. This place is dangerous, especially for someone like you. It's not like that. Whatever you may think of him, he doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job. And I'm lucky to have him. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe. Because if you and the boss go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is going to get caught in the middle. I can find the door myself. You should just get the hell out of here. Things are going to get ugly in a minute. Leave. I told you, I have to do this. Hey, you've been warned. Stick around, and you're a part of this, just like anyone else. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Hey, Sheriff, hold up. I gotta go in with you. Thanks. <laughs> it's a man's joke, bad lad. What did I tell you, eh? Stop laughing at me. Go ahead. You got a job to do. I ain't scared of you. Sheriff Wolf, sir. <sighs> Thank you, Tim. I know the sheriff isn't the accommodating sort, but you handled it. You did well. You can go now. Thank you, sir. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. All right, you got me here. Let's talk. Hmm. Yeah. I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how they screamed. The wolf is coming. 
And they would wait, hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. <sighs> oh well. Okay, aber so, was haben wir denn so erreicht? Also, spielen wir schon wieder wie die Mehrheit. Okay. Also, was haben wir denn hier? Okay, naja, ah, armer Colin, was soll denn der auch zur Farm? Und wer hat den Comic gelesen? Ich meine, der weiß, dass Colin auf der Farm nicht so glücklich wird. Äh, Naja, wir, ach, ich bin einfach echt so ein Casual-Gamer, würde ich sagen. Keiner, also die Mehrheit hat die Schleifen nicht entfernt. Die Mehrheit ist zuerst zur Schlachterei gegangen. Die Mehrheit hat gesagt, er soll nicht zur Farm. Ah, aber hier, boah, wir, wir sind total krass, weil wir uns erstmal hingesetzt haben, um mit ihm zu reden. Du, 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 das dröhnt euch jetzt wieder die Ohren zu und mich hört er kaum. Deswegen überspringen wir das gleich. Und werft noch einen schnellen Blick. Ich meine, ich wusste ja nicht, dass es direkt aufhört. Deswegen... Ähm... Zack, starten wir direkt mit... I mean, your eyes fünf. And the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? <sighs> not if I can avoid it. No. Holly's sister. Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he if he cares about it. If he even gives a shit. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? We're destroying the tree. No! We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey. You're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? I don't know. Snow will come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and... She doesn't really know who her friends are right now. <laughs> Miss Chuck. Oh God, Big B! This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, And the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Bigby, wait. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Das würde ich jetzt auch gerne überspringen. Äh... Ich, ich weiß ehrlich gesagt nicht, ob der Vorspann jetzt wieder so laut ist, dass ihr mich wieder kaum noch hören könnt. Aber, ähm... Das kann man ja, glaube ich, ändern. Ähm, 9 und 6, das müssen wir uns jetzt erstmal merken. Also, beides 3 hoch. So, jetzt solltet ihr mich hören. Ähm, die finale Episode von The Wolf Among Us. Ja, wir haben viel erlebt. Wir haben einen Haufen Ärsche aufgerissen, haben einen Haufen Frauen eingeschüchtert durch haarigen Rücken. Bin ich ja Gott sei Dank nicht so betroffen von. Oh nein, es geht schon los. 
Jetzt habe ich gerade diesen Monolog angefangen. Ähm, ich würde sagen, dann machen wir auch direkt die Musik wieder lauter. Ich dachte, das ist jetzt hier ein bisschen mehr vorgeplänkelt. Das tut mir jetzt leid. Puh, müsst ihr mich nicht so lange anhören. Also im Prinzip tut es mir nicht leid. Oder, also mir tut es leid, euch nicht. Ach, ihr wisst schon, was ich meine. You've come a long way. You must be tired. Das Bild war hier ganz cool. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Please, Sheriff. Relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. Got a scotch? Only Tennessee whiskey, unfortunately. Ach, das wird schon tun. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna... Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You know why I'm here. You killed those women. What women? Faith and Lily, the girls who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Did I now? I assume by your confidence in accusing me, you must have some proof of this, yes? Some allotment of evidence. A witness, perhaps. I know you did it. I'm sorry, Sheriff. I wish you had me dead to rights. I really do, for your own sake. But no, I didn't kill anyone. Those women. I don't relish telling you that the killings were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you and to assure you that it's over with. You really don't need to worry yourself further. An unfortunate bit of business? You're gonna tell me right now who killed him. Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? The man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? I'm already pissed off. You don't want to make it worse. You think I'm scared of you? It's all so. <laughs> You're nothing more That's than That's enough. A... I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but in the interest of preserving our alliance, if you have to know, it was Georgie. However, like I said, I'll be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie. You got what you wanted, so just sit down now. Yeah, I killed him, so what? You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. Why'd you do it? Why kill them? Does it matter? Look, the fact is... George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this! And then you attempt me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss what to do with you. This is right, bollocks, sis! You're just gonna let him do this? So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. What the hell? Take this fucker. Take all of them. I didn't fucking Don't start this. Don't make any trouble, Georgie. All right. Let's talk. 
You can't just hand me over. What the fuck was is this shit? Er you said hat. you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I give a fuck if I'm the one? Who the shit do you think you fuckers are? Get the fuck out of here. I do apologize, Sheriff, but I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit, but he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. I'm not going anywhere. This could have gone so well. Irgendwie spitzt sich das hier gerade so. To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Och nee. <lacht> Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you all fixed up. Jetzt geht's ja aber rund. <lacht> Ihr hasst mich jetzt wahrscheinlich, aber ich konnte selber nicht anders dann noch hier vorspannen, abspannen, pipapo in der einen Folge kommt. Dafür ist Folge 20, glaube ich, dann die nächste und da macht euch gefasst wohl auf einiges. Ich, ich mich ja genauso. Ich bin, es ist ja alles blind. Ich habe doch selber keine Ahnung, wie es wirklich weitergeht. Und hoffe, ihr gesellt euch zu mir auch beim nächsten Mal. Und wir sehen uns dann. Bis dann.